Okay, welcome back. So, in the previous episode, we took care of a mechanoid ship, another one that felt the need to uh, land here, or crash here more specifically. Um, so, we are slowly but surely getting the rest of our pen set up here. Found a little bit of silver. Um, I thought there was a way to kind of cargo bones. Naturally, it's just on this map. And it's not a huge deal. I don't really want to send an expedition over there just yet. Uh, just because I want uh, Ola specific uh, specifically to be up and ready so that uh, she can do a lot of the mining. Um, let's see. Zone. Zone. Move roofing. We still need a lot of steel. <laughs> um, wise. I know you're kind of busy with uh, doctoring and stuff right now. Okay, so yeah. Your main priority, though, is still research after any doctoring related issues. Bon, you need medical treatment? Ah, you're fine. is no longer incapable of walking. Good. 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 Yeah, we... I mean, that's really the main thing that's holding us back right now is a lack of... or a lack of uh, steel. Really wish that we could... Uh... Hmm. That's precarious. Oh, got like three of these things, uh, four, four of our power producing uh, things are currently damaged. Hmm, that's not ideal. Tola is fully healed. I'm thinking we are going to want to form caravan, go here, except we are going to want. I guess we'll take Katie, Wilkerson, and Tola. as well as our two mufflos. Mufflo can't really carry much, actually, so I will hold off on the mufflo and just bring some of the alpacas. We want to take the pregnant ones. Mm, might make some sense to um you should definitely bring like 
10 packaged meals. Berm. Okay. So that should hopefully take care of things. Pretty sure that one raid that was happening is long over, but I don't remember seeing the message that it ended. So, again, one of the risks with taking KD is the fact that they can't fight. And Wilkerson is old. No offense, Wilkerson. But we definitely need the steel. Wise is doing their job. Would be nice to have a second one, but honestly, just having one dedicated researcher always on there is probably more than enough. Yeah, I kind of wish it would just auto try and recruit people. I know that it's not always right or necessary to do that, but it can just be kind of annoying having to... Uh, why? Why right now? It's so annoying. Can you, like, knock him out, please? So that he'll stop. <sighs> this is so irritating. Of course, you're not actually doing anything to knock him out. He's still getting a bunch of insults out, so it's gonna... Cancel flying. I'm so irritated now. <laughs> like, really? Right now you need to be doing this. Okay, Katie finally stopped. That's so irritating. Because now Katie, uh, now Toll is going to have a massive negative debuff. So I don't even want to take, I don't even want to do stuff now because of it. Because it makes it so much more annoying. KD, what's your damage here? Well, you know, KD, if you hadn't been such a jerk, you could have gone on our trip, had a nice time, mined a little bit of resources, and then came back. No, you have to insult people, because of course you do. Of course you have to do that. Right as we're trying to leave. <sighs> right. Well, um, I guess let's. Go ahead. Okay, sorry about that. Sneezes. Or a sneeze. Um, we need to try to prioritize getting this stuff hauled in. We, okay, we never actually ended up hauling this stuff in either. Huh. <sighs> So much to do, so little time.
31 year old gatherer named Darren is calling from nearby. He is being chased by tribes people from the people of blah blah blah. blah. He begs for your safety and offers to join you at the fortress. Okay, so I guess we don't get to know anything about him. Unfortunately, this one gun is still down. Honestly, sure. Why not? <laughs> so, I'm guessing he'll show up at some point. Darren joins. Alright, what do you got for us, uh, Darren? Plants. Psychopath, okay. Lazy. And pretty. <laughs> Interesting, okay. He has some intellectual, he's a bit of an artist, and has plants. Okay. Unfortunately, he's coming from this side. I think this will be fine. Eesh, that's a lot. <laughs> Run, Darren, run! <laughs> yeah. Man, that's a lot of them. <laughs> Fortunately, we never got this thing moved in. We didn't get all of our traps reset. Okay. Might still have enough time to get this moved in. What is up with the fires over here? <laughs> Must have had a like a thunderstorm or something. Darren, I'm going to have you equip something. Still would have been nice to have gotten the stuff moved in. I'm not, I don't think, okay, they seem to be attacking, you are going to need to get back inside then. Yeah, I wasn't sure what they were going to do. Alright, let's, uh, let's go ahead and grab everyone. Draft. You might start destroying some of our stuff, which would be really annoying. Some of our turrets. Probably need another set of... Sandbags or something over here. Can I please select my unit? Definitely not a lot of common sense when it comes to the, uh, which thing I'm trying to select. There's so many of them. <laughs> now 
That's unfortunate. They ran away. <laughs> yeah, it's a little annoying that they're destroying. Ooh, that's interesting. Okay, they are running away. Unfortunately, they did destroy all of our turrets. Yeah, it's definitely one of the downsides of having all of these. They somehow steal our animals? Um, excuse me? What the hell is going on? <laughs> So confused. How are these ropes like extending this far and over top of mountains? Okay, the ropes the ropes keep fading in and out of existence. I'm I am very confused. Okay. Um I think this one is still alive. It's uh what's the deal here? Not likely to survive this. Your bio mining. That's kind of tempting. Um, who has good doctor skills? Kimmy. Ten without medicine. You might be able to save them. I'm not really seeing any more other than this one. And they don't really have any good skills. What's uh, the health like? Yeah, I'm not sure we're going to be able to save you, so... Bio... Construction. Ooh, you're worth it. I think. Vaughn, go ahead and... Tend... Okay, let's see. Who has some handling skills? Katie Tola. Alright. Well, I don't think we lost anyone. We got a couple people that are injured. Hopefully they're not too badly hurt. Let's just take a quick gander. Make sure that our guys got too badly damaged. Yeah, I don't think anyone did. Well, uh, I'm going to have you guys... Roping in and trying to rope in these two. to survive. It's your bio cooking. Eh, kind of fine without that. It'd be really nice if you pick up the other one while you were there, but sure. Okay. You're you're probably safe at this point we can go ahead and capture you like i wasn't sure if they were trying to steal my <laughs> alpacas i couldn't really tell i guess the alpacas probably just got spooked and ran off let's uh go ahead and capture this one you guys Go ahead and I think we're 
just gonna kind of let you go. I I don't think you're go ahead and strip them. <laughs> Since we know that we're not gonna try to save them. Well you uh yeah you're not make it at this point. <laughs> I think we assessed that you weren't really worth trying to save either. <laughs> oh, that's so terrible. I, I feel really bad about it, but I mean, from a pure gameplay perspective here, um, okay, you can go ahead and undraft. I think uh, we can undraft everyone at this point. Okay, I think everyone's good. Um, all right. I think it was walls, right? That was sort of our main uh, talking person. Let's go ahead and try and trade with Hadanum here. Do we want to sell anything? And do we want any of their stuff? Components, yes. Components are good. We can go ahead and sell a couple things. Oh, a couple of small alpaca males. I think that's probably reasonable. Maybe sell some more of our uh, packaged survival meals or something, just to kind of get the price a little more in our favor. Making a bit of uh, silver would be nice. Okay, I think that's good. Get those components, try and fix up a few things would be really swell. Member? Wait, what? Who? Did you just kill one of our goats that we just sold them? Are you serious? <laughs> That's so irritating. Why is this person in here? Like, seriously, how the hell did they get in here? We're going to try and arrest this thing, uh, this uh, person. This is really annoying that they keep, that they're in our base right now. I feel so bad for Porcupine. Must, <laughs> it must only cap at like three or something, but... They're also really, yeah, they're on the verge of starvation. We need to kind of force them to... Okay. 
If they are going and getting food, that's good. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, you're the unwavering loyalty person. Oh, that's annoying. No, I guess we'll release you. Oh, they're both... Oh, that's annoying. Okay. Well, I guess we'll release them both. I'm not really much of a slaver type of person in this game. Um, so... I mean, in theory, yeah, we probably could have done that, but that seems icky, so I'm not going to. Apparently we don't have any more rooms. We kind of need to get some more bricks. What are these? The baby goats? Did the baby goats get left behind or something? Or are they just taking forever to get off the map? Okay, well, it take a lot of rebuilding to... to to get everything back in order here. We're going to need to kind of prioritize this because, uh, yeah, it would be kind of crappy if another raid showed up right now. But that will probably have to wait until next time for the raid to randomly show up uh, when we don't want it to. So uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time.